and welcome to the Bob Stoops app. It's springtime, so we're going to, of course, talk about spring football. And the big OU spring game is coming up. Coach, I know this is always that fun time of the year when you were coaching. Now, as a parent and a fan of the game, you excited? I am. Uh, I, you're right. I loved spring ball as a coach. You, got to, you get to see these young players coming on and improving, you know, starting to find their way and be, you know, contribute to the team. And, you know, every uh, guy's mature, so, you're, you know, they're ready for it. And, uh, you know, just all the competition, all the scrimmages, all the practices, it was great fun. Um, and uh, I'm excited. I've been to a couple, three practices already. And, um, man, there's a lot of energy. And everybody sees Coach Venable's energy all the time. Oh, wow. But it's, it's there with all his coaches, and their their guys are flying around, really have embraced Coach Venables, his staff, and they're doing a great job. I'm, I was out there on their second, so it's only the fourth practice, second day in pads. All the coaches are on the sideline substituting. You, you'd have thought they'd been there for three years. I mm -hmm. mean, um, you know, Coach Levy on offense, the offensive coordinator, you could see his system taken taking hold players are really embracing it love watching dylan gabriel wow he, you know he can throw a pretty football he not? throws a great ball he's got great experience he's been on the field and started for three years you know to it anyways he's been in, in uh, coach levy's system at central florida so you know really looks good and then um, ted roof and the defense same thing uh their defense is flying around really hustling to the ball uh, Coach Venables is out there chiming in on defense, and I love it. Uh, I, I think they really, for just five, I think it's five practices into it, they really have a lot done already. I'll tell you, he's exciting, and I mean, you want to play for this guy. I mean, people are probably checking their eligibility because they want to go to war with this guy. Was he like that when he coached for you? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, you don't change, Brent. I always, I got a saying, people don't change, they just get older. So Brent, Brent has always had this kind of energy and passion for the game and uh, a mental toughness to it. And uh, he's really, you know, has, has affected everybody uh, in that building. And the players, I let, the best part of it all, the players have so embraced him mm -hmm. and the staff. I mean, they have a great connection there. And, and it's been fun. The energy on the field is really exciting to watch. And, and the execution. There's a lot of good football. And, and I know his staff and Brent are, are, and even Coach Schmidt, they've really been excited about the players and, and who we have on this team. You know, and their, you know, the, the quality of players, their attitude, you know, their toughness, the way they've worked. So it's going both ways. You know, the, you know, the, they really, uh, you know, just a lot of respect and, and, and a lot of positive. And over the last 25 years, you know, the, the openness of the practices, and, and rightfully so in some ways, have gotten more and more private. But Coach Venable says, I want to open it up. I want to open up with the friends, the family, the media. I want people to come out and experience OU football to give these kids more exposure. And that has looked like a home run for him. Yeah, I, again, he, people know what they want to do. They've seen Coach Levy's offense. They've seen Coach Venable's <laughs> defense. So you know what they're going to get. So why hide it? You know, just let it go. And, um, and I can't wait, you know, just the rest of spring ball and for the spring game that you, we were just talking about. Hopefully the fans out there will pack the stadium. You know, that, that would be a great start to show the support for Coach Venables and the whole program that we're all Oklahoma football. And, and the fans are a big part of it. So Amen. coming out and enjoying it and – you know, you'd like to think even some people who can't, you know, aren't season ticket holders, this is your opportunity to, to come enjoy the team and, and what we're doing. That's right. So what are you hoping to see in this year's spring game? You know, um, as much as anything, just good execution. It's, it's a big day to go out and, and to show, you know, the, the growth through these, you know, 15 practices through this month, month and a half. And, um, you know, and it, there's a lot to still be done before the first game next year. Yeah. But this is a huge stepping stone. The spring ball is a big piece of it. So I, I expect them to come out and play well. And one of the coolest parts of this year's spring game is we get to honor one of the greatest football players ever put on the Crimson and Cream, number six, Baker Mayfield, who you coached. And obviously he won a Heisman Trophy. How neat is it? For him it, to get a statue. It's fantastic. Um, you know, he brought so much to, to OU at his time here. And, and just the courage to come when he did and walk mm -hmm. on, earn his way, 
and then just his, you know, the, you know, the presence the whole time just lit everybody up, you know, and pushed everybody forward and made everyone rise to a different level and uh, just played so great for us. So it'll be really fun to, to see he and his family and friends back and, and uh, to enjoy that, you know, those couple of days having him back. It'll, it'll, it'll be great. And of course, Bob Stoops has a statue on the University of Oklahoma. Uh, do you have some unveiling statue advice for Baker Mayfield? <laughs> it's, 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 it's different. It's kind of a surreal feeling. And uh, I still find it odd, you know, when I walk by it or I'll come in the, the building. <laughs> You're like, who's most that? Of, most of the time I don't even look. <laughs> so, but anyway, uh, Baker deserves it to be up there with our other great Heisman winners and, uh, you know, I'm, it, and, and it's, you know, he's, he's been gone now four years, I think it is four or five, but anyway, it's, it's time. Mm -hmm. So I'm looking forward to it. And uh, I'm sure right on his heels, hopefully it'll be Kyler's coming, coming soon as well. Exactly. And excited about the future of Baker Mayfield in the NFL, because I feel his best days are ahead of him and a great day for the Mayfield family when he is honored on the spring game day. All right. For coach Bob Stoops, I'm Brad McMullen.